year 10 bronze dv welcome welcome to the countryside this is a trig point or a triangulation point you probably haven't seen one of these before and we're going to be using it in just a moment somewhere over there is warwick and behind me is leamington and we're not far from leek wootton in south warwickshire so we're going to do a little bit of bearing practice today in order to do a bearing you need a map and of course you can uh, buy a map you may already have a map or you can use uh, Digimaps via geography or you can of course print off a map from EDV. You also of course need to have your compass. There's no bearing without a compass and I'm going to show you the method which involves three steps. Right now we've already seen the triangulation point and triangulation point of course uh, looks like that on a map, a blue triangle. The first thing we do is we hold the compass in the direction of travel from the triangulation point to the field boundary that we're aiming for like that. Secondly, we then orientate our housing so that it's facing to the north of the map, so it's parallel to the map lines. Finally, we look at the bearing. The bearing there is 220 degrees and that's our bearing, 220 degrees. So we've got our 220 degree bearing. All we need to do then is to turn our bodies holding the compass until red is in the shed. We then follow our bearing of 220 degrees. Well, we've uh, been on our 220 degree bearing and now we've made it to our field boundary. And I know we're in the right place because if I look up, I can see some pylons and pylons cross this particular point. We also need to be able to do a bearing on the ground and we're going to go back to our triangulation point. So I'm pointing the compass back at triangulation point. I simply put red in the shed and I can see that I need to be walking on a 40 degree bearing back to the triangulation point. And here we are back at our triangulation point. Now it's very easy to remember how to do a bearing. You simply need to hold the compass along the line of travel. You orientate your housing so that it follows the north south grid lines on the map and you read off your bearing. So remember your one, two, three. So get out into the countryside on your daily walk that you're allowed to do and uh, practice some bearings. It will help you for your bronze DV.